Greetings. This is about the auto inscriber, contact auto inscriber that was I had learned about from TKH TKH Gaming, and I have followed it. And uh, this is about the pattern that he used and the issue that came up with the 118 version and forward, where the uh, ME interface that was used as the block over here was uh, no longer working to all the patterns. You need to add a pattern provider. And the solution that was shown by him on the YouTube, on his channel, um, included using a chest. I found that it wasn't actually needed. And so I wanted to share my solution in case it may be of help. Chances are he may already know that. He's definitely a very smart person. But here, what used to be the ME interface is now the pattern provider and in it as you can see are the three different patterns we're trying to create that's as expected and we have the ME interface which has nothing <laughs> but it's still there as it is necessary and over here we have the export bus for exporting the actual processors that was most of the changes the only other change I actually did was on these different inscribers besides for their storage bus what I had to do was in each one like this one for the redstone I also put in the different processors so it knew where to put them well actually where to store them after it's done creating them by mistake this one I didn't need to for the silicon because it was all being pulled out by the import and for the ones below, for the di for this one, as you can see, I've got the engineering circuit as well. So when it creates it, it puts it back in the storage bus there. And same thing for the calculation circuit. I put that back in the storage bus. And for here, the logic circuit, same thing, back into its storage bus. That was all of the changes I needed to make. Everything else is still the same. Nothing else has changed at all. And so that may help uh, make things work because now I can actually come over here and let's just go ahead and make one of those. Make one of these. And make one of these. And as you can see, they're all being made. So it works perfectly fine as desired, which exactly as he had made it. It's just the one minor difference was putting the pattern provider here and putting the ME storage on the side, ME interface on the side. That and marking all the different storage buses to hold both the input and the output of each inscriber they're attached to. And that was that was it. So thank you very much. I hope this helps with TKH. If you already know, I'm sorry, but still, for anyone else who may help, it may make things a little bit easier for you. So this is Double Pixel, and thank you very much. Have a great day.